<coughs> right. Excuse me, Darcy, I want to keep the here. Hello guys, welcome to another video. Um, yeah, it might be a little different, but I don't do this very often in March, but I thought don't come around over here, Mister. Not again. No, you can't come in. Sit in front of me. You have to be patient. I'm filming this stuff. That's based on I'm filming. Right, hello guys, welcome to a chat slash interesting update video. It's not going to be a normal chat video, that's for sure. Um, it's just to talk about. Um, yeah, I'm currently my proper dream layout, which I'm building uh, next week. I'm starting building it next week. So next week, sometime, probably around probably Tuesday or Wednesday, I'll start putting it together. So, yes. So, <laughs> stay tuned to that. My eyes are sore. I'm just really tired. Uh, yeah, it's just been an odd time of the year, really. Not much cold. It's a little bit cold spells, but not much. Um... Hope you all keep them well. Um, and yes, April is going to be, I'm going to have some time off. Not for the reasons I did before, but basically I'm going to give myself a break, come back fresh in about the middle of, probably going to take off from the 5th of April to about the 10th or the 15th of April. I'll come back fresh around the 15th of April from the beginning of April. From now till well, the end of March. So yeah, I'll basically take time off. The beginning of April, the 1st of April, I'll be still be filming. But the 5th, which is around Thursday to Friday, but I'm not sure yet. It could be on Saturday, which makes sense. But um, So yes, April, from nearly the beginning of April to the middle of April, I'll basically have some time off from filming and get my proper layout sorted out. I will be posting some pictures on Twitter, my Instagram. Um, of it, um, <laughs> I might even put a little video, little video for you onto Twitter so you can go and check it out. But obviously, I haven't done much with it as yet, but I'm getting there, I'm working things out. So, yes, it's the slow progress, and hope you guys all keep well and enjoying your time of whatever your hobby is or your life, and uh, yeah. You can't come over here, Darcy. Mate, you can't come over here. You can't come up here, Darcy. Can you wait until I finish filming? Hmm? It's only going to be under an hour. Right, 57 minutes. Try to keep your mind occupied with something. That's what you're doing. I'm filming Darcy, I'm not going to give you any much attention, come on, I'm filming, be patient. <laughs> That's 
so much rubbish up on this table, it's incredible. So anyway, um, if you do like this video, make sure you like, comment and subscribe and turn on post notifications to keep updated on my channel. Um, Darcy, what you doing? What are you doing? You're not thinking of peeing over there, are you? <laughs> this one could not behave himself. He likes to go and pee on it somewhere this time of year. It's not around my clothing because I don't want to be peed on. Are you that bored at the moment, Mr? Are you feeling springy? <laughs> You're like horses though, in that sense. You would like to be a mare horse. <laughs> cat. Um, yeah. Um, so yes, we are at a sort of chat video slash looking at books. I'm not going to show much, but I'm just going to show you a little bit, a few pages that I'm looking at. Both another heritage line is in Cornwall. Obviously, you might know it. Um, Somerset. Um, this is. Box to a railway, this is Truro Railway, uh, Somerset, we've got Somerset on here, uh, blah blah blah, Devon Railway, and this should be North Somerset or Midlands, this is all that Bobmin, Bobmin Parkway area. I don't know where Bobmin Parkway is in this one, but I think it is in one of the early ones. Midland Railway, what's that? That looked like Dorset, didn't it? The Great Western Railway. That looks like, um, that looks like me a bit of, uh, I can't remember the name of the place, but there was a few places around here. Just gonna flick through it, see if I can find the Bobby in the Winter Railway. Going back, going back a little bit more. Going back a bit more. Uh, come back further. The Bobbing Run to Valley. I do have another book on the Bobbing Run to Valley. It's a particular one I'm not going to base my heritage line off of. Um, for my particular dream now. So it will be a ten year run circuit. Um, so, yeah. The Bobbing Run to Valley. Nice picture. Um, this is, is this the bottom line? <clears throat> uh, Dorset, uh, Somerset and Cornwall. <laughs> that looks like New Key. New Key, where's Bobman? I always know when Bobman is, appears because it's got a, it says G, E, R. I don't know what that area is. I don't recognise that one. <sighs> anyway, I'm just going to flick through a page for you. Um, see if I can find the GWR area. I know it's GW areas. I think Devon is um, LMS, I think. Well, I could be wrong. I think it could be LMS, but I'm not actually 100% sure. This is GWR, so we're in the right air now. GWR. Right, we're in Cornwall, well, probably Devon, I think. Um, Somerset, blah blah blah. Uh, Great North Eastern Valley. Oh, my shoulders are hurting like mad today, guys, so I do apologise if I'm a little bit sore. Um, I'm just really <laughs> painful tonight. I've got a lot of pain in my shoulders. <laughs> I think it's that walking we did earlier today. Um, no, I didn't film it actually, I did I. Um, next time I go there, I'll film for you. Um, I just completely forgot about filming it. But don't worry, we've got loads of hedge line um, videos coming up soon because everything will be starting for the Easter. So, Bob Mini Winter Valley will be starting. There's still also the, um, the hedge line down in near Plymouth, which I'm going to this Easter. In luck. Um, I would definitely be down there on my birthday in the summer this year, without fail. Um, but uh, yeah, 
it's definitely going to be a day. <laughs> so you should see me on my birthday. Um, say hi. So, um, maybe chat to me. I'm fine with that. As <laughs> long as I know your name and everything else, I'm all right with maybe be friends and chat about trains and maybe uh, go to Heritage Line sometime. I think that'd be quite cool. Um, yes, that would be quite nice. Uh, we're in Somerset apparently now. The very long, very small and low viaduct. Wow. <laughs> that's huge. I wonder where that is. Uh, that's very weird. Uh, that is... Is that bombing? Doesn't look like bombing, does it? It was like something else. Central line. It says Rentu Railway, I'm not totally sure where this one is. It's got a huge viaduct in it. I can't show too much as I said, but I'm just basically showing it. Wow. This is the viaduct, was what's left of it. Half of it's still there, the rest is gone. Huh. First introduced um, 1960. The. Uh, I'm not sure it cost the... Oh, wow. Actually, I know where that is. That's not far from... Um, I don't think that's far from Plymouth, to be honest. I think that's across the, um, the river over Plymouth border before the other bridge been put in. The other valley bridge. Wow. <laughs> I think that's what that one was. Right, so 1937, 1930, all the way up to... Uh, 19, it's a, a stretch track for 371 metres, or miles, I think that is, till 16, 8, 2022. <laughs> so I'm guessing between 1600 and 1948 to 1930, so my granddad would been around at that time. Definitely my great great granddad before he passed away, he was been around in that era. So yes, I was imagine back in the day, a long time ago, this was that region where it used to be run through, I would assume in me. Um Foxwood Railway. I've never been to the Foxwood Railway. Um I'm definitely gonna have a go one day to check it out. Um Assuming the price of inflation doesn't go up too much with prices. Um, because, let's face it, we might end up living in train carriages, the way prices are going. <laughs> I'm not complaining if it does happen, because, um, living in a carriage or an old diesel engine as a house, probably be pretty cool, probably smells very diesel but still probably would smell pretty cool to be in. Right, okay. Um, I can't find it, I'm going to have to show you in a book. I'll post it on Twitter for you. But this book is a lovely book. I highly recommend it. There's a lot of guys that um, took part in this book. Um, it's the Britain's Railways. The whole of Britain, I think, from Ireland all the way down south and further afield. But, um, so yes, today is um, a chat video slash a model railway sort of idea video for this evening. So, the idea is, um, for this evening, it's me to talk to you guys um, about the new rally. And the reason I want to talk about it tonight is because you're going to see it. It's me to start building it 